I am here at the beautiful Four Seasons Hotel at Cello Restaurant, and we are going to get behind the scenes with Chef Colucci to find out the secrets behind his fabulous homemade Italian cuisine. Let's get in the kitchen right now. So, Chef Colucci, you are a native of Italy, and what part of Italy are you from? I come from uh, northwest of Italy, Torino. Uh, when I was 23 years old, I decided to travel around the world to start to understand uh, what's going on in terms of food. Finally, I came here in Midwest. So. And just recently, you've revamped the menu so that it really reflects your personal experience of food when you were growing up. Yeah, usually uh, everywhere I go, uh, I bring uh, some plate uh, is talking about my history, you know, where, where I come from, uh, why I decided to do this job. The food here is handmade, the best ingredients are used. The ingredients is the main important point. I have the garden outside, I love to grow fresh herbs. Then, of course, uh, as a chef, uh, we make the right combination. Uh, we work uh, to give different shape, different, different presentation. That is the, uh, our goal. And now, you're going to show me how you make your gnocchi. Yeah, we're going to make the gnocchi. This plate basically talks about uh, Italy, but Midwest. Because uh, here is really famous uh, the smoked meat. Uh, so we decide to smoke uh, the chicken and we smoke the mushroom. Combined with uh, gnocchi, uh, of course a touch of salt, parmesan, eggs uh, and pepper. So really easy ingredients combined together is a special prep. What I love about this dish is that it's rustic, but it's also luxurious. And to me, it kind of embodies the experience that you want to give here at the restaurant because it's approachable, but at the same time, it just feels like you're treating yourself to something. You're going to enjoy it. I have no doubt. Along with handcrafted Italian cuisine and a fantastic wine list, Cello also specializes in urban-fused craft cocktails. Cello is an ideal place for visitors to get a taste of St. Louis, but really, it is a local favorite that is just waiting to be rediscovered.